but let's make that smaller number. Okay. Same as always, Mickey dot text. Now if you scroll down this, you get the same thing. All the possibilities of properties and methods are all here. So here, these are the properties. You can select a property here. And then give it a value. So it has to be hexadecimal as always, zero, X. And again, we give it a random color, let's say a gray. Okay, when I publish it now, you can't really see that it's gray, okay, so I'll have to give it a slightly different color. Exactly, the same pink color as my circle outline. Okay, so far so good. Now, we have made two functions here, and both add this bit of text behind the bracket. That means that this function did not restitute any value. This concept is a little complicated until I show you an example. So I'm going to show you an example of a function that instead of not giving back any value, restitutes the value this time. So let's take this code and comment it again as I've done before. Okay, let's make a new function now. Function mini. Okay. Syntax is the same. The word function defines that this is a function. We give it a name and we open and close the brackets. To make sure that the function syntax is correct. And then we decide what kind of value this function will have to return. So we go down here and let's say we decide number. Okay. 